territory. What was Kallax doing here so far from Zaycor? If I want answers, I need to find him. And, for that, I'll need weapons and equipment. So we have a mission. That is to use the elevator. But this yellow mark is pointing me inside here. Yeah, that's something you've got to watch out for. The waypoints aren't exactly. There's no sort of. Uh, there's no level, no sort of height. So you know if the waypoint's beneath you or above you or on the same level. There's the elevator. Magnesium torch. There's an elevator. Push the button. There's the elevator. And push this one. Evacuation sequence initiated. Remain calm and proceed to the indicated exits immediately. Follow all instructions from service personnel. Thank you for your visit to the observatory. Observatory. My jetpack. Finally some luck. The guy that took my armor must have dropped it. Now. All I need to do is find a way out, cross kilometers of enemy territory, and find out why my brother tried to kill me. What could go wrong? So we'll grab Jax's jetpack, which is just here. And it's double, it's double tap space bar, and then hold. That's your one. There's quite a lot of fuel there. So you can't, you can move direction slightly. So it's always best to get close enough to a, a ledge if you want to jump up to a ledge or some higher place or lower. There we go. Just a little bit of getting used to. Anything to nick here? Anything to grab? Oh, ratty rat. <laughs> nice. Oh. Let's have a look in here. So, we've got worker pants. Big protection. Armour plus three. We'll take those and we'll tap the tab key. No, I don't want the map. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There we go, there's armour. And we've got worker pants, so we can just left click or tap enter to actually wear them. So we put those on. So we've got plus three leg armour. It's better than nothing. Toilet paper. There we go. How do you take toilet paper? So I've got a healing potion just there. Can't take anything else though. Metal scrap. Didn't look like metal scrap, it looked like a um, hydraulic piston to me, which might be quite useful engineering wise. But. Toilet paper, cigarette, what's the value of that? Only one, only one credit, but any little bit helps, doesn't it? I suppose. Can't take the boats. 
Now you would expect you to be able to take the boots. But obviously not too solid paper. There, but we'll leave that till later. Let's check in here. <laughs> I'll take the rat meat. dried meat gives you health of plus seven regeneration so it's one bet so it's one it's one black one health point per second seven seconds over plus so it's plus seven over seven seconds and scrap metal which has ten say we'll take that we've got a hammer we can't take the pliers that line around Anything else? Don't think so. I suppose we can always come back and look around again later on. <coughs> Did it again. You don't just get meat either, you get uh, bones. Oh, I don't know what bones are used for. There's probably a recipe that you can unlock. It actually uses bones as an ingredient. Edan, the land of the berserkers. If they recognize me, they could finish Kallax's job for him. It seems to be like a hurricane blowing. Or a very strong wind. Never seem to get calm days. Got a tiny shard of elixir. Not take anything else. No. Oh, large healing potion. Large healing potion. Someone here. He's not wearing Jax's armor, though. Come on, get up. If you're gonna make a habit of attacking people without warning, you should get better at it. I heard you before you even left the ruins. Someone tried to kill me. They stole my armor and my equipment. Then I find you here waiting to finish the job. First you attack me, then you accuse me of being a thief and a murderer? If I wanted you dead, we wouldn't be having this conversation. Trust me. You need to apologize. Got two choices. Like Terminator, isn't it? I don't apologize for nothing, asshole. That's double negative, but never mind. Prove you're not the thief, and I might trust you. I'll go with that one. Prove you're not the thief, and I might trust you. Only facts matter, not words. Trusting people quickly out here is as good a way to get killed as walking around without a decent weapon. 
Which means you just got very, very lucky. I can help you find a safe place and new equipment. If you stop trying to attack me. Why would you help me? That's my job. I look for people out here and help them reach Goliath. You'll be safe there. Safe? You could be some kind of slaver. What is it you really want? I want this war to be over. Until then, Goliath needs more people to survive. And people need a safe place to go. Well, a safer place than being out here on your own. But you're welcome to stay and risk being picked up by an ALB raiding party. Between them and the rot boars, you won't live long. Say, you didn't see anyone else up there in the ruins, did you? You're the first person I've found this trip, and it would save me a trip up there to check. Okay, so shall we be honest? You can save yourself the effort, there's no one up there. I didn't see any elves, I didn't see anyone. Lie? Why is that a lie? Ha, you're scared of the elves. No. God, you can save yourself with the effort. Yeah, we'll go with that one. You can save yourself the effort. There's no one up there. Well, and you got really lucky. An Alb Raider crashed a few days ago, and their scouts came through looking for it. Trust me, you don't want to run into a party of Alps. But, hey, enough talk. You need to decide what you're gonna do. I'm going back to Goliath, and you can come with me if you like. Safety, security, and you can find work to earn enough to buy equipment. If you want a chance to survive, it's the best offer you'll get. That's why I joined the Berserkers. Out here, drifting, and hoping to stay alive. I knew it was only a matter of time before my luck ran out. I know joining a faction doesn't appeal to everyone, but it gave me purpose. And what have you got to lose right now? Nothing from what I can see. Okay, what you say is logical. What you say is logical. Logical, right. Does that mean you're coming? Every choice you make adds up in this world. The way you speak to people will determine your course in life. Just take a look at yourself. No armor, no weapons, no companions. You've not exactly succeeded in life, have you? Well, all that changes today. Whatever you've done before, your life can start again. A new beginning. When the next Alb raiding party comes down from the north looking for Elix, the people of Goliath will defend you. You won't see the inside of a converter with us to protect you. Instead, you'll get a chance to prove yourself. To join us. Why do you want to help me? Like I said, Goliath needs people. Warriors, cultivators, hunters, storekeepers. Whatever your skills, we can find a place for you. You'll train me and give me equipment? If you stay, you'll have to earn your place. But... Be you cleric, outlaw, or alb, that's true everywhere. Sure, you'll get given orders and you'll have to follow the law, but it's not like you have things easy out here. Look, we can keep talking, but at some point, you gotta decide. So, what's it gonna be? Are you gonna stay here, or come with me? I'll go to Goliath. Your actions and words seem to match. I will trust you. For now. Huh. <laughs> yes, well, I'll take that as a compliment. You won't regret it. Combat, magic... If those interest you, then the Berserkers offer training to people who join their ranks. We'll make a warrior of you. We should get going. This is Rotbor territory. And you won't last long if a pack of them turn up here. Follow me to Goliath, and you can earn the Alexa to buy armor and supplies. Trust me, you'll need them. I want to find who took his armor, though. I want to find the thief who took my armor. Well, for anything stolen near here recently, I would start with Ray. He's an outlaw I found out here a few days ago. Very jumpy. Definitely looking for something. Where do I find him? Huh, I don't know. He disappeared off to the northeast. I'm guessing he went back to Tavar. But, hey, I wouldn't rush after him. He's probably sold your armor by now. Is that some place called Tavar? So that's another town. So we'll go with we'll go with the last two Goliath, I think. 
I will come with you to Goliath. Lead the way. Then follow me. And if we lose each other for any reason, you'll find Goliath to the east, at the foot of the mountain. Just look for the light from our mana shrine. You can see that from a good distance away. Oh, and the name's Durris. Pleased to meet you. Just lead the way. Very well. And keep up. Keep your eyes open. We're entering the hunting grounds of some of the local wildlife. Okay, so that's what I said at the beginning. It takes down your stamina. The longer you, long, the longer you sort of sprint or evade or use a weapon, every swing takes so much stamina. So I like sp actions like sprinting, shift left, tacking left, mouse button E, or evading cost stamina. If you're out of stamina, you can't perform these. You can't even get away from a target. So you need plenty of stamina. So that's probably the first thing you should build up on your character is stamina. It allows you to swing more often and also be able to evade more often and then get away if you happen to get attacked and sort of hit. You start taking too many hits and your health gets too low and you can't move away. You're as good as dead. And neither of us want to end up as rot boar food. What's all these plants around? So it's only to use. Oh, what's this? Healing potion. And a rusty axe. Let's change the weapon to Sana's fast use key. Quick use, sorry. Twenty two compared to twenty. Not it's only two points more, but it's better than it's it's actually better, so we'll wait. We'll switch to using that. Are you ready to go on? Let's go. Crap that. We should get moving. Okay. Watch your step. I've never come through this area once without getting attacked. So if it's too dangerous, if it's so dangerous, why do you keep coming out here? If it's so dangerous, why do you come out here? Magalan almost died when the comet hit. A living, breathing planet turned to ash and dust. But the Berserkers are using their magic to bring our world back to life. Just look around you. Edan is the greenest place on Magalan. They need more people. And they offer anyone who comes the same chance to start over. We should move on. One downside of all this plant life is that you can't see the rot boards coming. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. All right, and follow me. What's that? The town up there. Are you ready to go on? Yeah, we'll be in a second. Crap, there's no point in going to waste. We should get moving. If they're there, you might as well grab, grab them. Wooden bridge over there. Like I said, the world is out. Are you ready to go on? The world what is massive. What are the ruins over there? Remnants of the old world. A reminder that the past can be left behind. So what I'm talking about. Behind his head. Behind Deuce's head. You can see like a, a it's electric pylons. It looks like a, a very basic sort of earth type colony agricultural in nature like the buildings and everything just look so sort of basic can we find anything useful there maybe maybe a group of clerics came through this area a few days ago a scouting party reconnoitering Goliath well that was their plan instead they ran into a group of rot boars got chased into those ruins and haven't come out there's one behind his head just there, just came behind this tree. On the left hand side, the screen went right towards the building. Eaten by rot boars? That is no death for a warrior. Concern for an enemy? Well, you're right. No one deserves that death. I wish more people would look for common ground instead of shouting our differences. Why haven't you joined a faction? No interesting factions. 
I have no interest in factions. I cannot decide whether to join a faction out here. Let's go on. Well, we have a choice to make. You're short of equipment. We could see if the clerics have left any in the ruins. So just after that last response, it's a cold increase, which means the way you answer questions in the game increase or decrease the emotional content that Jax has in his mind. So it becomes more like an alb. Or more like someone like Duros. Or probably over emotional. You want us to go into the ruins? That's up to you. But there's a risk to that. So maybe we should just head straight for Goliath. I better warn you that the creatures in there won't take prisoners. It would definitely be safer to bypass them for now. So, what do you think? Shall we risk entering the ruins? Let's go to the ruins, get some equipment or whatever sort of supplies are in there. Let's go into the ruins. A brave choice. Opportunities are there to be seized. So, you took the hard path. You just leveled up, open your adjuty, ad adjutor. So that's what the tab key opens up, adjutor. But you, have, you also have shortcuts to different parts of the menu, sort of different, different menus within the adjutor. But you can just tap your tab key and find your, you know, the actual menu you need by using Q and D. So, you just level up, open your adjutor, adjutor with V to distribute attribute points. Find a teacher and spend learning. That's basically you can teach. You can actually learn new skills from teachers. You can also read them, as far as I can tell. So Those clerics should be around here somewhere. Um, have you noticed? Only when the menu it doesn't stop the world. So if you're if you're somewhere you could be sort of attacked, you could be attacked while you're in the menu. So it's something you've got to be careful of. So I've got ten points. Now. Toughness to has physical condition, it permanently increases in life energy and unlocks items and abilities. Dexterity. I don't know what actually increases your your stamina. I don't know if it's dexterity. I don't think I can't see it being const probably constitution. But I would say strength. Melee damage and lots of items and abilities. You've got I mean, certain items, I mean, like like the, um, we've got a, an axe, it's blunt one. For a good axe, it takes 33 strength to wield it. So for me, that's a little bit, it's a bit too high for me, to be honest, but. You can put as many points in, we can put 10 points in, it puts up to 20. But that doesn't increase your stamina. So I'm either putting to constitution for now. Dexterity, intelligence, cunning. So cunning increases social skills and unlocks certain abilities. For outlaws, it increases chem capacity. Is that actually telling what what actual abilities it, it gives you? So I'll go down. I'll take a look down here. Strength and constitution, yes, there we go. So it takes 10 points of constitution at each, each swing. At each swing, if it lands, does 10 points of damage. Obviously adjusted for the whatever it is that you're hitting. Whoever or whatever you're trying to hit with your axe or whatever weapon it is. So I think constitution, I think equally constitution and strength. Five points into constitution. And five points into strength. So five points into strength there and five points into constitution. And it's X to it's X Z to revert, so it's that's a cancelling the changes, or X to apply them. Let's try that. Yeah. So you've got more stamina now. That's good. Let's go. I don't know if it's gonna be enough. Nice. Bit more meat. 
Yeah, if you look at the roads, the road markings and everything, it's, it sounds like, like the countryside in the United States. With the solid yellow Are you lines. Ready to go on? And the old tech sort of. It's like a rural sort of culture. Let's sort go. of culture. A rural sort of farming sort of colony. Very reminiscent of sort of an earth that's been ruined by a comet. Not. We should get moving. Not an alien planet. Got another one here. What's that about here? <laughs> you have to. No! It's one of the bigger ones that's a rock bar. That's not like one of the ones that was attacked by before. It's a lot bigger. So that he's got problems down there, but this is a teleporter. So a teleporter for a small camp has been activated. You activated the teleporter, you can now return any time to this place through the map on your Judita. Adjutor. Must remember to actually pronounce that properly. Adjutor. So you tap the M key. And there's fast travel. Actually, right now we don't have any fast travel because we've only unlocked one single. There, enter the teleport. 